this UPS driver. I, I think people may have seen it. It was actually on Inside Edition, like uh, about five or six days ago. This is coming in the wake of the story of an Amazon worker who working at a warehouse um, in New Jersey died um, and some and, and 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 there's some question as to like whether this was uh, a you know uh, something that took place at his death but what is really be, uh, excuse me it was something uh, associated with his work it's like a steam um, it's like worse than this office I can assure you but of course we don't uh, we're not doing any physical work here so but you're working in hundred uh, degree weather 11 and a half hour shift um, I mean these things are, are nuts and these delivery um, outfits UPS even the US Postal Service is my understanding there's no AC in these trucks there's there's no sense of like hey uh, you, you know 20% less deliveries today because it's 110 degrees that's not happening this is a uh, apparently an Arizona uh, homeowner. Uh, they, they had a, a ring named, thing. Brian Enriquez had uh, yeah. you know one of those uh, ring uh, cameras, and caught this UPS uh, driver delivering a package to his house in extreme heat. Can barely um, he, he's basically like on the verge of of total heat stroke. Watch this. We're learning more about that alarming video of a UPS guy in distress from the extreme heat. He struggles to make it onto the front porch. Then he collapses, overwhelmed by the 110 degree temperature in Arizona. He has to lie down for a moment to recover. Slowly, he gets back up again and reaches for the doorbell before stumbling back to his truck. It's just a sickening feeling that you don't know what's going to happen to that guy if he goes to the next house or to his truck. Homeowner Brian Enriquez says he was shaken when he saw what his ring camera had captured. You can see in the video, he's looking at his hands, shaking his hands. I mean, he could have a mini stroke or anything. You may be surprised to hear that UPS trucks have no air conditioning. It feels so freaking hot back here. Drivers are taking to social media to share their extreme working conditions. This guy is drenched in sweat. To get air through the truck, the best way is we always leave the doors open. We rented a UPS truck right, to experience to what dri <laughs> rent his truck and drive around in his <laughs> but good for them for doing a story yes this. yes this type of stories need to be done more this is what news should be honestly yeah inside edition for the we first time they went inside the truck pretty <laughs> inside the labor actually, violation i mean it's like how can that how can you not air condition those trucks it's it, 2022 unbelievable yeah kowalski was saying just the other day when he called us in uh Aaron is not cool. Reminds us he lost like what, 20 pounds, 15 pounds? Yeah. 